All right, thanks a lot, Neil. And once again, now with Coach Mitch Stewart. While it's not the outcome that you wanted, still, though, a lot of progress made this season. First off, recapping this game against Austin P. Breaks didn't go your way, but even with that, you still had it down to a one-score game in the fourth. Then they just kind of tore it over there at the very end, a pick six and garbage time for that matter. Breaks didn't go your way, but again, that's football. Yeah, I mean, um, you know, it, this game, this is not the way we wanted to end, obviously. Uh, like you said, uh, the score is a little bit uh, deceiving to you just because there at the end we had, we had a couple of bad little – Bad little breaks there at the end. It kind of made it um, made the score look a little bit uh, worse than it than it really was. I was I was I was proud of the way our guys fought, um, but you know the, the bottom line is this: uh, the, the seniors, um, you know, especially the guys that've been around here for a long time. I was walking off the field with Quincy, and Quincy came up and hugged me and said, "Man, we started something." And uh, that right there, to me, um, that kind of says it all for those guys to get to go out on on that type of note. Um, and, and really feel like they're the, the, the group and the class that years from now can, can come back and say, hey, we were the ones that got it turned around. And now for the young guys, um, A, they get to bottle up this experience and this taste in their mouth and take that into the offseason. But now they've kind of got the torch passed to them uh, from those seniors where, hey, listen, we got it started. Now you guys have to do something with it. So i um, excited about the future, excited about this team. Obviously not the, the uh, end that we wanted tonight, but uh, awfully proud of the body of work this season and, and uh, how those guys fought all season. That body of work even showed through tonight, grit and determination, getting down 14 to nothing and still fighting back, battling back, forcing the turnovers, forcing the fumble, getting the touchdowns when need be. And again, that's all credit to those guys, those 16, those seniors that you're unfortunately going to be gone after tonight. But again, will never be forgotten their legacy of what they did here in 2018. Yeah, you know, it's just a testament of those guys and and uh, and their buy-in. You know, we we have a saying around the, the stadium: find a way in everything we do, whether it's. Uh, uh, whether it's a Thursday practice that, that got snow on the field and we've got to plow it up, you know, and all of that kind of stuff so we can practice, or whether it's coming uh, coming back from 14 to nothing deficit to uh, to having to have a, a, a kickoff return in the in the last 20 seconds of a game, um, that's kind of our model. That's our mentality. Find a way. We're going to continue that mentality moving forward, um, and we're going to keep on trying to find a way to uh, improve and and get better. And finding a way moving forward, you have a first winning record in a conference since 2011. That's a massive start. But again, 2019, it essentially starts tomorrow. Yeah, it starts. I mean, it's it's already started right now for all these coaches. I mean, we're we'll uh, we'll watch a little bit of it on the bus ride back, make a couple of notes, and we'll get uh, get together in the uh, in the morning, and uh, we'll start putting our plans together for recruiting, um, and start putting our plans together for the off season and strength and conditioning and all of those things. Um, you know, 2019 starts right now, and I'm excited about it. I'm excited about the guys that we have coming back, um, and uh, we're not going to waste a minute trying to improve and develop those guys. All right, Coach, as always, thanks you for your time, consideration, and effort that you put for the program for us on the radio and television broadcast, and best of luck to you in 2019. Have a safe trip back home. Thank you, guys.